Welcome and namaste. My name is Jana. Today's conversation is actually about your inner conversation and or your inner dialogue that you have with yourself every single day. Are you aware of your inner conversation or your self-talk? Is it loving? Is it kind? Is it compassionate? Is it helping you achieve your desired outcome or goal if you have one? And I would like to share an affirmation and or a conversation that I started having with myself after I was in a car accident when I was 26 years old and I was bedridden for about six months. And five minutes of movement was an accomplishment and it was an incredible breakthrough. But I was back in bed for six, seven hours at a time because I needed a lot of healing time but I needed to make sure that I couldn't let that get me down. I knew what my goal was, and it was not only to be out of pain and to have a normal life, but it was to achieve optimal health and vitality in all ways. This included physical strength, stamina, flexibility, endurance, as well as having the energy that I needed or desired to achieve my goals and thrive within myself in my body and in my life. Now, just because I used this particular affirmation or thought process or concept when I was in an injury or recovering from an injury, it doesn't necessarily mean you need to use it for that. You can use this for anything. You can use this to achieve a particular desired goal in your weight or fitness goal or um, just in general, your vibrant health and vitality when you go work out, when you go to the gym, when you do yoga, whatever it is that you're doing, you want to apply these principles or this concept. So I'm going to share the affirmation with you, but I first want to make sure that you A, uh, suggest that you know what your goal is. What is your desire? So again, in my particular situation, it was to achieve optimal health and wellness in all ways in the most loving, kindest, compassionate manner. And then he needed to check in and make sure, do I have any non-beneficial fundamental beliefs or anything that would make me um, not believe that I could reach my goal? Now, in that particular situation, and actually in many situations in my life, I was told I would not be able to either stand straight by the time I was 30 years old, that was 20 something years ago, that I would not be able to do yoga again, that I wasn't allowed to play in sports or do activities, that I'd never be well. I was told that many times in my life. And you, so you wanna make sure that you don't have any of those conflicting beliefs from anyone in your past. And these were experts that told me that. And I was not going to accept that at all for myself. And I just knew that there must be a way to create perfect vibrant health and vitality within my body, but also succeed in my life in all ways. So that's my viewpoint and I do everything that I can to make sure that there is nothing at all standing in my way of me receiving and experiencing life to the fullest with love and just delight and fun. So that's what I wanna share with you today. So here we go, I'm gonna share this positive uh, affirmation and I'm gonna just keep adding to it. Now just as you're listening to it, know that you can change it, you can mix it up, you can make it your own. This is just an idea that I think is really, really important because I hear and see how people are talking to their bodies. And I'll tell you, your body is your vehicle. It carries you through this life. And the more loving and kind and compassionate you are to your body, the greater chance you have it, it, of it responding to what it is that you are wanting of it. So your body listens, it hears every single thought you think, everything you say to your body, it says yes to, it responds to. So it's really important to have a positive, conversation with yourself and with your beautiful body that does so much for you. So here is the positive feeling thought, because you want to bring a feeling to it, that I started using for myself um, a long time ago. And here it goes like this. Thank you body for responding positively to everything that I am doing. I love you and I appreciate you. 
Thank you, body, for responding positively to everything that I am doing. You can keep it that simple or you can add on and it would be something like this. Thank you, body, for responding positively to everything that I am doing, to all of my fitness, all of my workouts, all of my regimens that I am doing. Thank you, body, for responding positively and helping me achieve my goal of wellness, of health, of vitality, having energy, strength, and vitality to accomplish and or do everything that I desire to do in my life. I love you, I appreciate you, thank you. Now you can add on, so you could say, thank you body for responding positively to everything that I am eating, drinking, and or consuming. I know that you're being nourished and vitalized by everything that I am eating, drinking, and or consuming. And you can name what those things are. They could be some kind of vitamins or minerals or herbs or supplements or Western medicine, whatever it is. Remember, your body is responding positively to everything that you are doing, eating, consuming. So then you can even add I am affirmations here in the now moment, even though you might be in process of achieving your goal, there's only the now moment and we want to state everything in the present tense as if it has already happened. So it would be something like this. Thank you body for responding positively to everything that I am doing. I love you. I appreciate you. I am happy, I am healthy, I am fit. Thank you, body, I love you, and I appreciate you. Now you can keep adding on to this. You can add um, food, as I already mentioned. You can add all of your healing regimens or therapies or even soul sessions or energy work, whatever it is that you're doing, you can make it your own and add to it. So this is just a little positive thought conversation um, that I started doing for myself that helped me a lot and I would love to know how you like it, if it works for you, and give me any feedback. My name is Jonna at jonnatrimmer.com, creating wellness, happiness, and to help you thrive in a loving, compassionate way throughout every day of your life. All my love, namaste.